Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back for another TOS video. Right, so we're here at floor 29. Uh, we're almost there at the end. So here we have Mono Fire as the requirement and then cost limit as per normal 110. Which is very generous, I would say. So here we have a Greek setup. So do not blame me for just running Greek all, all the time because uh, you will really need a Greek setup in order to really pass this. Right, uh, I would say this Floor 29 will be the hardest uh, out of all the battles, right? I feel that this is even harder than um, Floor 30. So you can see here, uh, round, round 1, Battle 1, we have uh, these two water mobs here in which they will convert water runes whenever they attack. So if you're running this setup, you can pretty much um, tank two hits without healing uh, which isn't a lot right so uh, I I would say that uh, you shouldn't store at battle one but you can store here right we have Yuki Ona here with just frozen runes uh, a bunch of frozen runes in fact so uh, she actually generates four frozen runes every time she attacks so oh my mistake uh, four frozen runes uh, every turn you know, she, she don't have to attack but every turn she'll just generate 4 frozen runes uh, which is quite a handful to dissolve so I would say you do not have to go for the offensive here uh, the offense here so just to uh, focus on dissolving all the frozen runes here and then with this you can actually store your CD here and make sure you have um, sufficient hard runes if not you can go for the Deepankara um, hard convert uh, everything should be fine as of now. So for this setup, uh, what we have here is Achilles, uh, Deepankara as I mentioned earlier, uh, Agatha as well as Scrooge. So um, the main converters will be Agatha and Scrooge and then pretty much you need all, I would say you need all of these team members here to, be, to have a smooth run. Right, Achilles here definitely because we have a water, uh, water boss and then we are running they, they force us to run a mono fire right? which is not a very fun thing to play you can see that uh, it's very painful grinding down this Yuki Ona already and then there is much much more at the back so here uh, I would say try to dissolve all the frozen runes that would be the best uh, there is one point of time whereby they keep freezing that one rune that I, I can't dissolve Right, in, in which it just ends up as one big clump of frozen runes at the end. So here you want to store for this uh, Achilles because you are going to use it very very soon. And then uh, Scrooge as well. So my Achilles isn't all max so it's going to take a while to actually get ready. Hence you can see here a uh, very very long grind for this um, Yuki Ona stage. Right, so you can see, notice I already have uh, two frozen runes at the bottom together with the hard rune over there. Uh, I did not have hard runes to dissolve and you can see the next round here, I actually do not. I probably did not like dissolve all the frozen runes also. Right, so notice I have another hard rune that is frozen uh, in which I cannot dissolve. Cannot dissolve it as well because um, I do not have any hard runes. Right, so uh, this battle itself is a very painful experience for me. Right, so notice that uh, I have very very limited fire runes here, and then I decided to go for the Agatha convert uh, before I end up killing myself here. Right, so it's a very long grind, so I do not want myself to die here. Hence, uh, no harm using the Agatha convert. Right, uh, if you guys want to use it, just use it. So we barely, barely made it for battle 2, so with this uh, off to the next battle which is this um, Doman. Right, Doman here we, ha we have hard shield, so in fact my uh, initial plan is to go for the one, one spin together with Dragonic Compulsion, stock up on hard runes and then do a mass convert for, for hard runes right, using Deepankara's active skill. So you can see here all my 
uh, hard runes are being fro uh, frozen, so uh, hence I can't I can't go for the compulsion because I got to heal up for that particular round. So here we're gonna do it the the long way, which is every turn I have to dissolve um, hard runes just a bit. You have to control the number of hard runes you dissolve because uh, one round of rune drought uh, that's gonna be game over for you. So you can see uh, by dissolving three hard runes and uh, a couple of, of sky drop for fire runes to boost up the recovery, it's actually sufficient for you to heal back to full HP. Right, so you can see here uh, once you're running low on HP, uh, then I decided to go for the five five hard runes. So you notice this round I I did not have any um, hard runes left, so I was praying that uh, 4 hard runes was more than enough to take down the first HP bar, and it did. Right, so here you can see Hephaestus, oh, everybody is up, so let's turn on Hephaestus, Scrooge and Achilles. And what we have here is actually Doman with Trojan. Right, Trojan and he's gonna reset any skill that is currently ongoing, which is like Meteor. Hephaestus, right, which is why I did not turn on Hephaestus on the first HP bar. Okay, so um, why did I bring Agatha here is because of um, this stage. We have this random fire column, three fire columns in fact, um, by these three mobs. So it's a very irritating skill in which uh, you can't really spin well, right, and if you have low HP, that's it, you're definitely gonna get burned, and then you're just gonna take all that burn damage. And these three mobs here is actually pretty bulky, so you need a decent amount of damage to kill it. Right, they are on CD2 with a skull if you're running this setup, so uh, pretty much you only have two turns to kill. So, next up, we have Shuten Donji here, uh, the PR version. Right, so, notice that I got burned a couple of times at the front because uh, I did not read the skill properly. We actually have fire trills. Fire trails together with Enchanted Shield and then he cannot be controlled Meaning that Medusa Freeze uh, Things that delay the CD and stuff like that cannot be used at all Alright so he's on CD2 uh, So pretty much more than enough time for you to heal back So here you just gotta watch that fire trail and then pretty much conserve Conserve your hard runes whenever you have full HP so that whenever he attacks, you will have sufficient um, hard runes to actually heal back to full HP within one spin. So you can see here, uh, without much sky drop is going to be a very very long battle. Um, I don't know whether it's a good thing or not because partially I'm actually saving up my CD for actually storing back my CD for this um, Scrooge as well as Achilles uh, where I use it right at the start. I feel that it's ne actually necessary to use it at Doman stage because um, it's actually kind of risky if you do not have uh, a lot of sky drop it's definitely not going to kill Doman especially when he's in water attribute uh, damage wise it's not going to deal a lot for the Doman stage uh, okay so uh, boss we have this uh, what we, what's this guy uh, the joint operation card the obey so above 8 combos and he's gonna damage you based on the difference of the combo made if you dissolve anything lower than 8 combos so which is why I say um, the, the back few stages is uh, in favor of Greeks is because of all the skills like this uh, imagine you're not running um, Greek it's quite difficult to pull off uh, above 8 combos every single turn especially uh, you have to run mono fire imagine you're running Minota whereby you've got spin columns um, not a very fun thing to do so I would suggest running Hephaestus for this battle for sure alright so um, 8 combos for Greek 
is easy peasy. So off we go, first HP bar, second HP bar is actually um, resetting demons if I'm not wrong. Reset resetting demons and he's gonna convert uh, water runes every time she he attacks. And then together with enchanted shield. So as I mentioned, uh, this battle is basically more inclined towards uh, Greek. So Greek, uh, enchanted shield isn't a problem. And look at the, the sky drop. The sky drop is really trolling me at the back part. Second HP bar. Uh, sky drop is very very bad, hence I go for the compulsion. So notice compulsion actually went for the, the storing as well. Uh, was really paranoid whether this this guy is gonna die or not. Alright, so you can see with the full board um, of fire runes by Scrooge, uh, I managed to activate all the cards amelioration, which actually boosts up the damage by a lot as well. So with this we are done with floor 29, as I mentioned it's going to be like the hardest, one of the hardest battles uh, for this event. Alright so what we are left here is uh, pretty much the top of the tower which is floor 30 and then we are going to do that in the next video. So with this we are going to end this video here, thank you so much for watching, see you guys in my next video, bye bye.